How to find a business coach or mentor. Are you looking for a business coach or mentor to help you get your business off the ground? Do you want to avoid all those beginner mistakes by working with a qualified business mentor, but you can't find one? If you want to know where to find help to grow your online business, you're in the right place because in this video, I'm going to show you how to find a business coach or mentor. Hey, hey, welcome back to my channel. If you're new to me, my name is Courtney Sanders. I'm an online life and business coach as well as wife and mom. I wear all the hats and do all the things. And in today's video, you're in the right place because I am a business coach. So look no further. You can just click the link below to reach out to me and my team. You found your business mentor and that's the end of the video. See you guys later. Just kidding, just kidding, just kidding. <laughs> Even though it would be great if you click the link below if you wanted to work with me, but I get it. You might be out there looking, you wanna find the perfect business mentor just for you. And I know how that feels because I have worked with my fair share of business mentors and I'm fortunate to say that it's all been fantastic. I've had great experiences every single time and I love all the people that I've worked with who have coached me over the years. It's just been super fantastic. So I know that I would not be where I am today in my business had I not worked with business coaches and business mentors and I want you to have that same experience. So if you're looking for a business mentor and you're looking for someone other than me, even though you need to be working with me, click the link below. No, just kidding. But if you're looking for a business coach or mentor, then I'm gonna tell you what I would look for and what I've looked for in my own coaches and mentors in this video. So let's get into it. All right, so the first thing that you wanna consider if you are looking to find a business coach or business mentor is you wanna look for someone who has the results that you want. This is so key. So unfortunately, there are a lot of people out there who jump into coaching, and not just in business coaching, but any type of coaching, health and nutrition coaching, life coaching, et cetera, and they only have an academic understanding of their subject matter, but they don't have personal experience, and in my opinion, they don't have personal expertise. So if you throw rock and hit any one of my videos, you're going to hear me talk about real results, right? You want to make sure that you are coaching on something that you have real results for. And when you are looking for an online business coach or mentor, you want to see if they have real results as well. So first thing you want to look at is do they have real results in their own business? And so if they're telling you that, you know, they are a social media business coach and they can help you get tens of thousands of followers on social media, but they themselves don't have that, then that kind of raises the question, are they gonna be coaching you out of academic knowledge or are they gonna be coaching you out of personal experience? So the thing that I look for, when I look for all of my coaches that I've worked with, and like I said, I've had great experiences across the board. I don't have a horror story. All of my coaches are fantastic and I would definitely work with them again. But the one thing that I made sure that I did is this first tip that I'm telling you is I looked for someone who had the results that I wanted. So make sure that you are looking for someone who actually has has the results and can speak from experience, not just this kind of academic theoretical knowledge about what you need to do in your business. All right, the second thing that you wanna look for is a business coach or mentor who has the lifestyle that you want. Now, I know this kind of seems like, well, what does that have to do with anything and this isn't a big deal, but I found that it's a big deal, especially for me, as, again, as a woman, as a wife and mom, because I found that there were a lot of business coaches who were single as a Pringle and they had no problem working you know, 80 hours a week in their bachelor pad and all of their business strategies revolved around that. And so I knew that that wasn't going to work for my lifestyle. So I was very specific about finding business coaches and mentors who had a lifestyle that it was either similar or modeled certain aspects of my lifestyle that were very important to me. I have small children. As of this recording, I have two kids, you know, four and under, right? And so they take up a lot of time. I'm married. I want to spend time with my husband. I like to travel. I have experienced what it's it's like before having a business model where I was working with clients one-on-one -on -one, back to back and I could barely take a break to use the bathroom let alone you know do some laptop lifestyle traveling like it just wasn't happening and so I made a commitment that I was never going back to that business model and so it's very important for me to work with coaches who have a business model that supports the lifestyle that I'm looking for so don't get me wrong there are a lot of successful people out here if you just type in business coach on YouTube you're bound to find a ton of channels with lots of successful people 
that might be great for you to work with. But for me, I need to make sure that they're not just successful in their own right, but they're successful in the way that I want to be successful and that they're living a lifestyle that I want to live. And so I don't want to have a super successful business, but a horrible marriage and a horrible relationship with my kids and my family and all of those things. And so when I look for mentors, I do this kind of 360, you know, assessment of them. I do. And I want to see if they have all the other aspects together that fit for me. And that's how I make my choice. All right, the next thing that I look for when I'm looking for a business coach or a mentor and that I especially recommend for you is that you look for someone who has achieved success in a similar situation. So again, this person might be very successful and they might have results for themselves and they might be successful in their personal life and they might be living a lifestyle that you wanna live and they're achieving that success in a way that you want to achieve it. However, do they understand your situation and can they help you get success in the situation that you're in? So so I look for coaches who came up kind of similar to me, right? So I worked a nine to five job. That was a unique situation because oftentimes I had to get up super early, like three, sometimes four o'clock in the morning in order to work on my business before I went to work. I was working on it in the evening. And again, I had these family commitments that I was juggling and balancing. So I like to look at other business coaches and I'm trying to find out, hey, did you build your business in a similar vein? Did you build your business while on the side while you were working a nine to five job? And if they did, didn't, if they didn't achieve their success in a similar situation to me, I look to see if they have student results, which we're going to get into in a second, where they have gotten success for other people who were in a similar situation to me. So it's either got to be them or their students, but I'm looking to see based on the situation that I'm in, will your strategies help me achieve success? And I know that based on their own personal stories or the stories of their success cases with their own students. All right, I have more strategies where that came from when it comes to finding your perfect business mentor or coach. But first, I wanna hear from you. What do you look for when you are looking to find a business coach or mentor? Go ahead and drop it in the comments below. All right, the fourth thing that I look for when I'm looking to find an online business coach or mentor is I'm looking for someone who has an extensive online presence. This is important for me personally because this is a part of my evaluation process. And so this is also why I preach to my own students why they want to build a body of work because oftentimes a lot of the people who are thinking about working with you are silently thinking about working with you, right? They're not gonna send you an email and say, hey, I'm thinking about coaching with you. Can you answer this laundry list of questions? You might have occasionally people who do that, but for the most part, people are kind of making their decisions on their own. And then when they decide, okay, this is the person that I want to work with, then it's all bets are off. They're contacting the person and then it's off to the races. But before then there's an extended period of time. It might be a few days after they uh, first stumble on your content online. It might be a few weeks. It might even be a few years. I have new clients who have just joined my new coaching program now who have told me that they've been rocking with me since I was doing hair videos on this here YouTube channel so you know shout out to my old hair videos if you want to see some some funny videos from me being in college you can watch my little natural hair tutorials from like over a decade ago so after this video feel free to check that out but I have clients now who have literally been watching me since then and what have they been doing they've been consuming my content and checking out my body of work and so that's how they knew that I was the coach for them so for you I highly recommend that you find someone who does have an extensive online presence because it's gonna make it easier for you to evaluate all of the other tips and strategies that I gave above. All right, the fifth thing that you wanna do is you wanna look for someone who has gotten results for others. And so I alluded to this in the point where I was saying, I wanna find someone who's gotten success in a similar situation to mine, whether they did it for themselves or they did it for someone else. I wanna know, do these results work for other people? And this is a big one that even my clients, you know, look for me. In fact, I've gotten a lot of clients who have been very impressed because I had uh, a doctor recently who had a six figure launch and she quit her job as a doctor can you believe that she quit her job as a doctor to get into online business coaching because my strategies helped her do that and she's now making more money in coaching than she was as a doctor so that's an example of a result that I've gotten for someone else that my new clients who are coming in are evaluating when they're deciding if I'm the coach for them and so if you're thinking about coaching understand that your clients are gonna do the same for you and so you want to make sure that you practice what you preach and so when you're looking for a mentor make sure that you find someone who has gotten results for others and if you wanna check out my results, they're on my website. I'll put a link somewhere in the descriptions, but you can just go to CourtneyLSanders.com slash testimonials. And I don't know, maybe at the end of this video, we'll splice in some of the testimonials from my clients, but make sure that whoever you're working with, that 
they have gotten results, not just for themselves, but other people as well. All right, that's all the tips that I have for you today. But if you want even more strategies where that came from, I invite you to join me on my Million Dollar Brand Masterclass. This is actually a replay of a masterclass that I did live. It's got a lot of great strategies and suggestions. It's very, very in-depth, and it talks about how I built my Million Dollar Brand. And so if you're looking to find an online business coach or mentor because you have aspirations of building a million dollar or maybe just a six-figure brand as well, then I highly recommend that you sign up to watch the replay of this Million Dollar Brand Masterclass. It's really good. I'm really proud of it. It's brand new. Go ahead and click the link below before I take it down because it's just that good. All right, so that's it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Make sure that you subscribe. And if you can't wait until my next video, I understand, I understand. Make sure that you are following me on my podcast, which is The Courtney Sanders Show, on both iTunes and Spotify. And if you can't wait for the next video or the next podcast, then you can check me out every day on my Instagram. I'm at least posting a story or something on my page and I'm sharing even more strategies like these in these videos. So that's all I have for you and I will see you in the next video. Bye. The good thing about Courtney is that like she like like lays out everything, like the whole blueprint, like the templates. Like Courtney's like, this is step one, you know? <laughs> this is step two. You know, here is the template to do step one and two. And then you can ask me about it when you do it. So. <laughs> Just like following her steps one by one and then replacing it with my business, you know, my brand, my own tone, my audience, all that kind of stuff. And so I did the master class. I got about 80, over 80 women came to that class. And then I pitched my bundle and I made like $5,000 from that master class. I've taken and invested in Facebook ads and all those things, but no one taught me the system that I need that Courtney taught me today. <laughs> No one taught me this and there's no way I could have done this all by myself. I have never seen anybody create any podcast, any free webinars, like anything, even paid webinars. <laughs> and I paid like thousands of dollars in coaching programs that told me that I needed systems, but they didn't give me this. <laughs> so, this was so amazing and I'm so glad that Courtney created this program. It was so on time for me. Gosh, the sales script has been a game changer. Oh my gosh, I can't say enough about the sales script. Um, it, it is amazing, like it, it works. It's very service-based and the questions of getting them to think like, oh my gosh, like I never, I've never thought about it that way.